What's going on guys? Um, so we're actually just about to pull into the Myershank headquarters. We're in Pataskala, as I've just learned to say. Uh, just outside of Columbus, we drove down today just to do a few uh, small adjustments uh, with our steering wheel uh, and a little bit to do with the seat before we go to California next weekend. Uh, we have one more test before the, uh, well, two more tests before the season gets started, but this is going to be a really good one for us. We're really excited and we're going to give you a shop tour. Uh, I think that's one thing that's come up quite a lot recently. So um, hopefully, if the weather keeps cooperating, Maybe we'll even get to see a little bit of the new shop and I think we're all very excited about the Maya Shank Racing's new headquarters to be. So I hope you enjoy this day with us. Hello. This is it, it's snowy, it's cold. Same as Indy. We're in Columbus. Uh, so we're here inside the reception of the Myershank Racing Building. Uh, obviously, as you can see behind me, just a few of the helmets and trophies that the team have amassed. Uh, obviously, uh, hoping to add to as many of them as possible. Uh, we'd like to see a few more big ones right here in the in the middle. So, uh, pretty sweet entrance way. We're going to go back into the actual shop itself. Uh, hopefully, you guys get to see the car and show you all the best we have to offer. The real boss isn't here today. <laughs> Michael's in. Let's take a peek. Yo. How's it going? Good man. We've got you on camera. Uh huh? You on camera? Oh, <laughs> good to We're just doing a little shop tour. Okay, That's good, okay. Good. Uh, the, the, it's a disaster though. The shop is. Uh, yeah, we're we're still okay. packing for moving. Yeah. yeah. It's all good. Okay. All good stuff happening. It's all positive. Then. It's all good stuff. It's all positive. Follow me. Check the Race shop. Yes, you Right, I was doing. Maybe a name. I feel like people name their cars, and I don't think I've ever named a car. What do you think? Could have a fans out. Could have a. What's a good name? So here she is, part of our challenger oh. <laughs> for the year. Uh, so today we are working on steering wheels um, and paddles on the back for clutch, uh, for upshift, downshift. And because of that, we changed the steering column length a little bit. So time at the track at the minute is, is so valuable, um, you know, with COVID precautions and things like that. So it's just easier today to come down, see everybody, obviously just say hi, and then just make sure that when we get to the track, we're just ready to go. I think I prefer that. I've got a bit more like, a bit more angle, or a bit more like scope to grab it. I feel like the angle comes out, that comes out more like to you, but this comes out more flat. Right. Oh, slip me. Forgot how much easier it was to get in without the screen on. One thing that's different now too is all the league mandated had to go back to the SBA system from okay. Drone Tech. So lining the spline up, you know, when you get the wheel on, stuff's a bit tricky. Oh, right? is it? Now give it a push with, without pulling it. Yeah, push on it with just and push forward and then pull back on as well. Make sure it's on. <laughs> I like that. Huh? I like the one where you just push it on. So did everyone else until they couldn't get out. Until they couldn't get out. Yes. So uh, go ahead and power the car up. And then Uh, yeah, so we have some changes on our steering wheel uh, compared to last year and the only good way to really figure it out and test it and see what was good is by hopping in the car and trying it but there's also 
if I didn't like something, there's time to change it before we test. But if I didn't come today, I wouldn't know. So then we get to the track and I could be stuck with something that uh, maybe I don't prefer as much. Um, so yeah, just doing that. And honestly, just to come and see the guys sometimes. See, I haven't seen them all for a while in the shop because of COVID and whatnot. But um, while there's time to prepare, we might as well try and do it. Save one less thing at the, uh, at the track. So yeah, that's what we're doing. Uh, so let's just do like a little walk around the shop. Uh, this is our primary race bay. There's our second car. The I was asked to tell you to make very clear the shop normally much tidier than this. Obviously, with the new addition to the DPI car, plus packing and getting ready to move to the new facility, things are a little clustered today, which is fine. Um, but let's go for a little, let's go for a wander. People say that in America. Uh, no. <laughs> they don't, they don't. Go for a wander? Yeah, go for a wander. No. You can just go for a walk. Strolling. Or a stroll. You can go for a stroll. So I think normally the shop is split into IndyCar side, sports car side. This is the side I keep asking to occasionally join for certain races. Daytona 24, I keep asking to be a part of it. Maybe one day I can be, who knows? Um, I think we all agree the new DPI car is really cool. So there it is. The, obviously the guys are all working on it. I do keep asking to drive, it will but then <coughs> normally you guys I hope one day you could see it actually I hope you've seen the new shop but all this stuff normally is very much in its like specific oh, and it's designated area it's just there's so much going on right now with you know the addition of Elio's car as well plus a new DPI car it's just uh, there was a, there's a reason we're having or well, the team are building a new shop it's because they need more space which is a fantastic sign of growth it just makes it a little a little cramped today so then this is where they do like bodywork repairs. This is where I hope we spend the least amount of time. People in today, it's just that time of year where everyone's getting ready to gear up for the start of the season. I know that they already did Daytona and had a really great outing for the first time. Uh, but obviously Sebring's coming up for them. Obviously our season's starting so it's 100% effort, 100% of the time at my shank racing right now. Uh, so that about wraps up our day. Uh, sometimes it's the longest drive for the, how long we actually spend here, but honestly it's, it's such time well spent. Uh, I've also ended up coming back with two helmets, one for me, one for Elio. So Elio, you better be nice to me, otherwise it might not arrive at Laguna. Uh, so yeah, we're going to make the trip home back to Indy, but all this was just to get ready for our Laguna test, so uh, just excited to be back on track. It hasn't been that long, but it's felt like a while watching everybody else practice, so everyone at the team is just really excited to get going. <laughs>